Hey, my roses. So I'm walking Charlie. By the way, I brought my sister home. Um. Oh my God, I feel so bad this morning when I was bringing my sister home. Are you good, bro? Oh my goodness. Look at all the space, but you have to walk where Charlie's walking. Um, I felt so bad today. My sister dropped her brand new phone from yesterday, like that she got for Christmas, and the screen cracked. That really sucks. I'd be so mad. Right now I have like my freaking camera wrapped around my wrist with like duct tape. That shit ain't falling right now. By the way, I'm using my new camera. Oh, and the weather said it wasn't supposed to snow until like January 9th. No, January like 4th. And look, snow. Anyways, I'll see you guys at Walmart because it's boxing day. Is it box? Yeah, it's boxing day. And all the stuff are half off. And I'm trying to get some. Okay, so we're at Walmart. And I have to admit, I'm not really impressed. I got the one thing I wanted and that's what I'm getting. Okay, so I'm home now for my boring Walmart haul. I was expecting to bring like, uh, to buy like a few stuff, you know? But there's nothing really left and my Walmart was kind of boring. <laughs> but I got this and it was um, originally like four something and I paid two fifty for it. And it's a pumpkin spice Burt's, Burt's Bees. I know it's a good brand. I never buy stuff from it, but um, I put on my lips before. Let me put it again for you guys. <laughs> my lips feel so nice. It smells so good too. Um, it's not like too strong, but it's like good. Lately, I've been really into like chapsticks. At first, I really wasn't. Until I bought my other one and I realized I started using it a lot. And it makes my lips look cute. Not cute, but nice and like hydrated. Also, um, my mom bought me this because she bought it for my sister. And this is the only thing I really wanted at Walmart that was going to be half off. This is basically what I just went for. Oh, I just noticed it comes with a makeup bag. Um, I think Walmart always has cute Christmas sets of brushes. I showed you the ones I got, but let me show you again because I took them out of the package. They're so freaking nice. Like, can't wait. I'm really satisfied with everything I got and I'm like, I appreciate them a lot. Anyway, so, um... Yeah, me and my sister yesterday filmed uh, us doing my face mask I got for Christmas. So here's a little, well, here's a long clip of us trying it out and kind of reviewing it. Okay, guys, so we're going to try the face mask I got. It's kind of heavy, feel it. That's it. Yeah, you have to wait up in here, hey? Two liters or two pounds? I forget what they said. I don't know. But, um, let's see. Okay, mix healing clay with equal parts of raw apple cider vinegar. Okay, yeah. Apple cider. Vinegar. The vinegar is upstairs? No, it's... Oh, apple cider vinegar. Or bad. you could do it with water, but apparently apple cider vinegar is like the real... Like the real mm. result. Okay, best to use it in a non-metal bowl. Cup. Okay, what's it doing? This is on your bed. I wonder if there's like a little scooper in here. Where we Imagine that would be bomb. Dot com. You should buy one of those, sir. That would help you. So you manage how much you put. Yeah. You don't uh, waste it. And I'll leave it in there. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So I guess we'll use this. Okay, so I'm not bad with measurements. I just need English instructions. Bad with measurements. Okay. Okay, so to dry, it takes 5 to 10 for delicate skin and 15 to 20 for normal skin. I was yeah. like... We're climbing the mountain to clear skin. Climbing the mountain. Beauty is pain. Mm -hmm. Apparently, it's supposed to hurt a bit, like when it dries. There's another face mask, the other one I got, and that's like a... I don't know if you saw them, it's the ones that... You put and it dries up black and it like, you peel it off after? They were trending a while back. I think so, but I'm not sure. Yeah, we'll do it another day together. Why, you have that one? Yeah. I 
kind of like the idea of you mixing it yourself because you kind of get more product, you know? Yeah, and you can like um, prevent from using too much if you don't want to use a lot. And this is only 20, like $16 for two pounds. I 16 think. US or 16 like Canadian. Canadian. So in US it's like 14, 13, I don't know. I got some in my hair, bro. Oh, so what does <laughs> a lot go? Okay, this one doesn't do. I don't. I hope not. But I don't think this one does much to your eyebrow. But the other one peels it off. This one just like dries up. It'd be a good story time, right? The time I face mask my eyebrow off. Okay, I guess I'm done. Yeah, we definitely didn't need to. We were worried we weren't gonna have enough, but we have like a good chunk at the bottom. Yeah, for real. We can do this like on two other people or at least one. Mm -hmm. So basically, this should last me like a year. Yeah, for real. Okay, so it's starting to dry a lot. And it's itchy as a mother. To be honest, I didn't think the it was gonna dry fast in 15 minutes for the like the tick layer. Oh, it dries fast and it's so itchy right here. I feel like what? I know me too. I look like a turtle or something. With all the cracks. You know what I look like? A turtle? Um, no. What is that movie again? Uh, Suicide Squad with that guy who's made out of rock. Okay, I know. I, know. <laughs> I look like that. Okay, so it's officially dry even though it looks wet. Um, I feel my face is really tight. Not enough to hurt. I didn't feel like the pulsing that the thing warns you about or that they said, um, or that I've seen people say they had. But my sister said, my sister went and washed her face off already. But she said she felt that on her forehead. And, um, yeah, so now I'm gonna wash it off and I'll show you my skin and tell you how it feels. Okay, so I just finished doing mine and my skin does feel really nice and soft. And I find it just like not too red, but over here. Yeah, like over here she's red. And I find like if you would have saw a before and after picture, like you see that, let's just say there was like pimples that were like ready. Mm -hmm. And then after the um, clay mask completely like kind of lowered them down, it's like she didn't even need to pop them. She didn't need to touch them. It's like the mask yeah, did it over all. Over here. Yeah. yeah, like did it all itself, you know? That was really good. My sister wants to take some home. She likes it that much. Cause like, it's a big, like, for $16, like that's a lot. Yeah, it goes a long way for real. And like, we even like put too, we even like made too much, so. Yeah. And I, imagine what it's gonna do for you, like for real. And I think next time, I'm not gonna put as thick. I'm gonna put like you did the first time, like just a. Thin layer? Yeah, cause I find like it, yours face looks like. I kind of feel like I waxed my face, like I said. I, right? I was like, what are you talking about? And then I felt it when I was rubbing it, like the the chunks were like... Exactly, yeah. It won't bother you. And the pain, like, I don't feel like my pain was that bad. I feel like yours is worse, because... <laughs> <laughs> the redness. But you know what I think you you did uh, wrong? I think you did a thick layer. That's what I was thinking too. Try doing a thin layer, let's see. Because I noticed uh, all here had thin layer, and it was the part that affected me the most. Uh. If you notice, my forehead is not that bad, and there was a thick layer hmm. there. My nose was not that bad, it was a thick layer. But all here that I did a thin layer, it, it affected me. Yeah. So I think it's like, a little goes a long way for real. Hmm. So yeah, I would definitely do it again. I think I'm going to do it like once a week. Yeah, for real. And um, yeah, so it's a really good mask, and we recommend it. You could get it on Amazon, and then maybe places sell it locally. You have to look, I don't know. Okay, my roses, so... This is the vlog. Um, let's end it with a quote of the day. It's so much faster to access now because I have my new camera and I'm using my phone for the quote of the day. I okay, so today's quote of the day is, If you cannot lift the load off another's back, do not walk away. Try to lighten it. That's a really good quote. Help others if you can. And, um, yeah, I believe in good karma, so... What you get is what you get. No, what you give is what you get. So yeah, guys, I hope you guys had a good Christmas if you didn't watch my video yesterday. I'm saying it again. And I'll see you guys tomorrow or maybe not. I don't know because Vlogmas is over. So now I get to come and go as I please, I guess. Anyway, so see you guys. Bye.